the world of energy generation a subject of fascination and innovation. From Thomas Edison to Nikola Tesla, the great minds of the past have continuously sought ways to harness, generate, and transmit energy more efficiently. Among these explorations, the Rodin coil has emerged as a compelling avenue for those intrigued by the possibility of free energy. This essay delves into the intriguing realm of Rodin coils, their potential applications, and the growing community of enthusiasts dedicated to exploring their possibilities. It all began with Marco Rodin, a mathematician who unveiled a revolutionary theory grounded in Pushnary theory grounded in Pythagorean-based mathematics and inspiration from the Baha'i scriptures. Rodin's creation, known as vortex-based mathematics, introduced a new dimension of understanding that sought to simulate the ether field model and minimize the resistance within a coil. This revolutionary concept ignited a wave of enthusiasm among those eager to explore the uncharted territories of energy generation. The core concept behind the Rodin coil is to reduce resistance and compress the magnetic field within a coil. While various coil geometries can accomplish this in distinct ways, we will primarily focus on Rodin's coil geometry in this exploration. It is worth noting that there are other intriguing coil designs, such as nested coils, which exhibit wireless power transmission capabilities and high voltage surges. These nested coils hold the promise of remarkable effects, although the details of their operation are still unfolding. Additionally, there are interference coil designs, although it is believed that this particular coil may not possess the optimal shape for its intended function. One of the most intriguing aspects of relationship with the concept of free energy, the Rodin coil is often regarded as a unique variant of the bifiller coil, which has long been associated with the potential for generating free energy. If the bifiller coil can indeed produce free energy, then it follows that the Rodin coil may also hold this remarkable capability. However, to avoid any potential misconceptions, it's vital to clarify that the Rodin coil, by itself, does not emit free energy. Rather, it serves as an essential element within a resonant circuit, contributing to the reduction of harmful feedback in generators. Harmful feedback in generators, in essence, it plays a role in enhancing energy efficiency, but it does not stand alone as a source of free energy. In examining the nature of free energy, we find that the bifiller coil, when incorporated into a circuit, can indeed be a key component in the generation of free energy. The bifiller coil, as utilized in Master Ivo's circuit, is responsible for managing high-frequency wave functions. These wave functions can be likened to electrical oscillations in the field of physics, mirroring the behavior of mechanical oscillations. The bifiller coil is meticulously designed to ensure that these vibrations resonate effectively. Consequently, this resonant behavior allows the output power to surpass the input power within seconds of starting the circuit. This remarkable feature of bifiller coil-based circuits holds the potential to tap into the concept of overunity, where the output energy exceeds the input energy. It's important to note that Nikola Tesla, a renowned inventor, had delved into the technology of exploiting back EMF, electromotive force, for self-running generators, thereby pioneering the concept of a free energy AC generator. Returning to the Rodin coil, it is fundamentally an evolution of the bifiller coil, stemming from the inventive genius of Nikola Tesla himself. Dating back to January 9, 1894, the Rodin coil marked the inception of the shift from conventional alternating current, AC, technology to high-frequency innovations, notably illustrated in the Wardenclyffe Tower. Rodin coils have found their place in various electronic circuits, including Joule Thief circuits, where they contribute to the generation of free energy. This remarkable technology has not only captivated the imagination of enthusiasts, but has also attracted the attention of experts in the field of ether physics. Ken Wheeler, considered the foremost expert on ether field physics, has made an intriguing prediction. He envisions that the toroidal Rodin coil may become the cornerstone of AC generators without the need for rotation, ushering in a future where portable batteries provide high voltage, alternating current without the traditional rotation-based mechanisms. While Rodin coil devices labeled as free energy devices are available for purchase on e-commerce platforms, it's crucial to clarify their true nature. These devices do indeed achieve overunity where the output energy surpasses the input energy. However, their power efficiency may not yet be sufficient to fully replace traditional grid electricity. Nonetheless, they serve as a tantalizing glimpse into the realm of free energy, indicating that such possibilities exist and merit further exploration. In conclusion, the world of Rodin coils and their potential for free energy generation is a captivating and dynamic field of study. As we journey further into the mysteries of this technology, it is clear that the human quest for harnessing the forces of the universe to provide clean, and abundant energy continues to evolve. The legacy of visionaries like Marco Rodin, Nikola Tesla, 
and those who have contributed to this fascinating realm paves the way for a future where free energy might not be a mere dream but a tangible reality. And finally, we have a gift for you that is tricks to reduce your electricity bill by at least 75%. And the way to complete energy independence, get rid of the monopoly of big energy, you will never have to pay for electricity. electricity. Method, amplify electricity to make output power greater than input power. See link in description. Thanks for watching.